It was reading the, uh, the news of the world and I saw the competition and I thought it's not every day you get to, to train like a star, um, so I entered it and So, well, I hope you have a good day. Um, if, you know, anything you want to ask along the way, please feel free. I'll try and be as helpful as I can. Um, and it's been it's been good fun. We've had a tour of the uh, of the stadium. I learned a few things myself about the stadium that I didn't know. So I'm going to give you the opportunity to, to come up and do that in a moment or two. Uh, you can be here we go. Walking out, you can hear the players talking to each other, and then you hear the steps as the players go down here in their studs, and then the roar of the crowd as we go out there. got a, a training session which I'll be involved with. As soon as the balls come out, I'll get involved. I won't, I, you know, I've done my own warm-up. <laughs> Well, the guys that are putting on the sessions are, you know, they're, they're full-time coaches. So the the, the warm-ups and the, the training drills are all, um, you know, realistic. Yeah, we wanted to give them an insight into what the academy coaches would do with the boys, and also what the first team would do. The, the warm-up and the, the dynamic stuff is more around the first team. And the actual session is probably more for an under 15, under 16 academy boys session. Um, a, a lot with the ball, making decisions on the ball, not trying not to tell them what to do. Let them make the decisions and see if they can make the right ones. And if they don't make the right ones show that they can learn. If they can't learn, and that's when we obviously step in and try and guide them towards the right answer. So I thought it was going to be, um, you know, when you, you don't expect it to be that intense, you thought you think you're going to do a bit of a bit of a warm-up, a, a couple of stretches, then maybe a bit of shooting practice, and that was going to be it. We would have had a good day anyway, but I'm actually really pleased they put it through, put us through our paces like that, because uh, it makes your word up, gives you a taste of, uh, gives you a taste of um, what the Chelsea team do. It's just little things you don't think of, like how you create space and you know, learning off coaches who, who do it every day. It's, it's, it's a good benefit for people like ourselves who play a little bit and um, we can take it to our own games as well. Yeah, and, and the preparation as well, the preparation that the, that the, uh, the pros go through is um, like particularly Chelsea and, and, the, and the top side is second to none. It is difficult, obviously, mixed ability, but I think the enthusiasm from the group has been great and that's kept everyone alive. There's been players who still play semi-pro now and there's probably players who haven't played for since they're six, seven years old. But the enthusiasm has been there, it's kept the, the whole group alive and they've done really well. We had a little challenge at the end on the speed gun and a couple of guys got 65, 66 and uh, they didn't fancy Graham and he saved the best to last and he hit 71 miles per hour and showed us all up. So he's, he's still doing good at his age. 
hope you've had a great day. Um, we've certainly enjoyed it, as we've said on numerous occasions. Um, we've got some certificates for everyone. We've got a couple of presentations. They're a little bit random, you know, because we didn't get a chance to see. So if you didn't get a, a presentation, if you didn't get, don't get a prize, you know, um, don't worry. Until next time. Absolutely awesome day. I've had a fantastic time to be honest. Um, you know, everybody's been great. The guys, um, Graham and has been fantastic as well. Brilliant. It's amazing. Once in a lifetime opportunity. You can see I'm a Chelsea fan as well. I can't really go on. <laughs> Alright, both of you are here. Uh -huh. I think it's always important that, that you know football clubs um, are, are accessible for, for people, fans, people involved with the game, albeit indirectly, um, and that the doors are open. And, and I think that, that you know something Chelsea have always done, I've always done as a player. You know we've we've had lots of different people around the tra either at the training ground or at matches, and I think it's important that that, that you show that a different side to, to to a football club, any football club, and. Um, you know, I, I've always enjoyed, I think, sharing my world with, with you know, people that have come down and, um, and I think it makes you appreciate, you know, the opportunities you have as well as a player.